All right, and welcome to our next episode of Mr. Felstrom's Precalc Cast. Today is benchmark 10.3, the tangent angle or subtraction formula. So we're going to use the uh, addition formula listed here to find the tangent of 75. Now, uh, tangent of 75 can be expressed as the tangent of 45 plus 30. And using my tangent addition or subtraction formula, the tangent of A plus B is equal to tangent of A plus the tangent of B over 1 minus tangent of A times the tangent of B. I'm just going to plug in uh, our 45 and 30 for A and B. So I will have the tangent of uh, 45 plus the tangent of 30 all over 1 minus tangent 45 times tangent of 30. Now uh, to evaluate those I have my special triangles over here. I want the tangent of 45 that's going to be 1. So I have 1 plus tangent of 30 is opposite over uh, adjacent which is 1 over square root of 3 or square root 3 over 3 uh, all over 1 minus and again tangent 45 is 1 and tangent of 30 is square root 3 over 3 so I end up having this uh, fraction here 1 plus square root 3 over 3 all over 1 minus square root 3 over 3 now, uh, a couple of ways to handle this uh, as far as simplifying. Uh, I can't have the square root on the bottom. That's that's the, the main part. So what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to multiply the top and bottom by 3. And what this will do will, will eliminate that uh, 3 in the denominator and turn this from a complex fraction to a regular fraction of uh, 3 plus the square root of 3 over 3 minus the square root of 3. And then to eliminate the square root, I will multiply by the conjugate uh, 3 plus square root 3. Conjugate of the denominator, that's when you just change the, uh, the, the middle sign so that when I use the foil, uh, the square roots cancel out. So on the top I have 9 plus 3 square root 3, 3 square root 3, and then the square root of 3 times the square root of 3 is 3, all over, uh, foil that, you got 9, plus 3 square root 3 minus 3 square root 3, and then a negative square root 3 times square root 3 is negative 3. And all of that simplifies to 12 plus 6 square root 3 all over 6. And that will then simplify to 2 plus square root of 3. And there we have our final answer. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.